Hello everybody, my name is Mr. KVG and today I'm going to be showing you how you can solve this error message now showing up in the screen in Apex Legends, normally known as device hung, this application's device failed due to badly formed commands sent by the application. This is a design time issue that should be investigated and fixed. Yeah, now we all know that there's many reasons why you can be getting this error message showing up on your screen um basically i haven't seen any like anything on google with what i'm about to show you now this is basically working for those guys who don't actually have a graphics card or a proper graphics card per se like for the guys that's using a stock graphics cards people that's using uh, laptops instead of normal gaming computers or normal computers for that matter but this should work for you let me just advise this is not a permanent fix after you've switched off to your computer switch it back on again the, it's going to show you this error message again let me just advise you it's not a permanent fix it's just a quick temp fix that um, you should be able to pay for like 12 hours at a time and so so i've only played for about six hours so i haven't had any problems after doing this fix right so enough jabbering let me show you what you need to do okay first things first you're gonna want to make sure that you've exit origin completely right um after you've done that you if you want to make sure that you've exited origin you're just gonna go Windows, um, not Windows, Control Shift and Escape or Control Alt and Delete. Can you click on Task Manager? Then you should find Origin somehow. I have Origin on it at the moment. Like, see, here's Origin. Make sure you don't see Origin anywhere on your PC. So now I'm gonna make sure. And Task, my fan is going on for some odd reason. That's weird. Alright, so um after you've exited the origin then you should be able to go into the next step step two would be to on your keyboard windows r okay now in this little thing i don't know what we call it you're gonna want to type out percentage program data percentage and slash origin we'll give you some time and now okay so once this file is opened let's maximize that for you you're gonna want to control a to select everything in here make sure you uncheck local contact and service logs as to you should not delete i'll say again local content and service logs do not delete that too service logs won't delete either way but local contact do not delete it all right you want to go and press ctrl d make sure everything is deleted why is this taking yes so i have already done this so Ah well, I'll just do it. So it's it's fine. It's not gonna harm me in any way. <laughs> so um, after you've done that, you're gonna exit. All right, back to your main screen. We're going back to Windows R again, or the Run thing, whatever you wanna call it. Same thing, but this time you're gonna say App Data. All right, App Data. Shouldn't be just simple. I don't need to. I don't still need to wait there. Um. Now in here, you're going to see three files, all right? You go into local, this one. Not those two, only local. Go in there. Now, you have to look for origin in all of whatever you have here and stuff like that. So just to make it quicker, you're just going to press O, and there's origin right there, all right? And I go do that and delete it right you've deleted origin you go to your recycle bin and um it's about it now comes the the last step in all of this 
You're gonna wanna close the windows, power, and restart. Not shut down, restart. After you've restarted your PC and all of it, you're gonna go into Origin again. And um, this is just an optional step. Actually, let me do it for you. Oh, what am I doing? I should have it here somewhere. Origin, here we go. You wanna go back into Origin? I don't know if it's gonna work now because of what I've done now. Okay, it's working so far. Alright, you wanna go back into Origin? And just give it a moment or two. Alright, now that you're in Origin, as you can see, there's my name there. If you want to jam a game with me, just send me a message on whatever. I don't really know how all this works. I don't really have friends here, so I always play alone. It's better that way. Um, now go to game, my game library, and then you're gonna right click on this and say repair. Okay, repair game files. This will take some time, about five minutes to be in it. And let that happen. That's only optional. You, you can do the whole cache delete thing without um, repair Apex Legends scenario, or you can repair it if you want to. It doesn't really matter. It's just an optional. You can test it. If it still gives you the error, you can try and repair um, or, um, Apex Legends and test it out again. So after you've done all that, you can go into Apex Legends and play the game without that error message disturbing you again. Well, it will basically disturb you if you let it. So basically this means every time you wanna play Apex Legends, you're gonna have to do the whole Windows R, program data, app data, and yeah. After all of that, you're still gonna have to do this each and, each and every time you play Apex Legends. Now, I don't know if there is a permanent fix for this. I'll try and figure out the way. But um, if my explanation on this is just too much for you, uh, if you're not understanding it or in any way, I'm not saying that you're stupid or anything, but I'm just saying I will leave a link in the description below with a step-by-step -step analysis on how you can clear cash and like basically it's all explained it's actually on the ea site the eahelp.com site i will leave a link in the description you can go there for yourself and yeah you can do it that way if you want so anyway if you guys like the video thank you so much for watching if you didn't like the video you're more than welcome to dislike the video but if you liked it leave a like subscribe to the channel if you're new and um let me know in the comments below what you think about the video and if it worked for you and if you are in fact using graphics card a normal gaming piece um, gaming pc and this fix actually worked for you please be a chip a happy chippy <laughs> and leave a comment on the description below letting me know that this fix actually works and letting everybody else know that this fix actually works for everyone else but if it doesn't work for you you, you can just, <laughs> I don't know, like, go on your merry way, look for some other fix maybe, or whatever. So, okay, let me not waste any more time. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next video. Ciao.